What's up everybody, it's your boy Beam here. For breakfast. <laughs> For breakfast I had um, five packets of oatmeal and a banana. Um, that was pretty good. Um, I didn't have any coffee this morning. Technically I did, but I didn't have any coffee with breakfast. Um, and you know, I brought a can of coffee to school. Um, and I had that during my literature class. Literature class was good. Um, we talked about the essay we're gonna write, which I haven't started yet. I'm probably gonna start it tomorrow. We'll see. I'm gonna start it tomorrow. But, um, you know, we'll see how that turns out. Um, yeah. Uh, and I drank the coffee during literature class. I'm trying to get off coffee. Um, you know, I'm gonna be replacing coffee in my morning routine with aspirin, with all these headaches I'm gonna be getting from caffeine withdrawal. But I think caffeine is bad to depend on. And I'm pretty used to, you know, doing, like, I'm pretty used to getting on and off caffeine, you know. Uh, what else? Back there is an EpiPen. I'm allergic to all nuts except for walnuts. Um, and so, and it's not bad enough to where like I can't go into Five Guys, for example, um, but it's bad enough to where if I sort of, my mouth comes into any contact with nuts, I sort of start projectile vomiting, right? And I might get an allergic reaction. So it's generally good to have an EpiPen. I've sort of just thrown that cardboard box in my backpack, but today I bought um, on Amazon an EpiPen holder. It's bright red, has a big like plus on it. So if I'm ever having an allergic reaction and I'm out and about and I have my backpack, I could be like, hey, at the bottom of my backpack, there's this red sort of zippered box. I don't know what my parents are talking about. Um, there's like a red zippered bag and you could just pull out my EpiPen and, and poke it into my thigh, right? Um, and, you know, I also bought 40 N95 masks. I try to wear N95 masks when I'm on public transit because it's so spooky. You go on there, everyone's coughing, and I'm like, man, I'm definitely getting COVID-19. In the first, like, week of school, I kind of got a little sick, and it was horrifying, uh, and I definitely think it was from public transit or something of the sort. Um, so just, like, nine, like, like, 70 yeah, like 70% of my person contact is on the way to and from school per day. So I just wanna minimize a majority of my potential of getting sick. Uh, so I like to wear masks on the train and I'm out of masks. So I bought an 85 mask, they should show up tomorrow morning or tonight. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, for lunch, I had quinoa salad um, after literature class. My buddy I met during uh, college orientation showed up and he said hello. And then it's like four friends showed up and we just sort of talked. They're, they're all pretty nice, you know? I don't, I don't know them that well. Um, you know how that is, like when you only know one person and they know people, it's strange. Um, but you know, I feel like it went as well as it could have gone with that scenario. Um, so that was pretty cool. Um, and then after that, you know, well, while that was happening, I was eating my quinoa salad and uh, you know, for dinner on the way home, at the strip mall I got um because I take the train to downtown and then I take the bus from downtown to the strip mall and then I walk home from the strip mall I could do a thing where I walk less uh, but I like walking home from the strip mall because it's pretty good exercise um, at the strip mall I got um, quite a bit of sushi so I'm gonna have some sushi I'm gonna have some Cheetos that's gonna be dinner it's gonna be tasty I'm pretty excited um, and yeah that was pretty much my day I'm just hanging out uh, yeah all right see you dude.